today, Kevin and I went to Dairy Queen. Um, thank you to everyone who has told me about these, uh, especially Austin on Facebook. He has told me I need to try these. These are the special uh, Oreo blizzards that are out for uh, <laughs> for the 4th of July. Um, one is the Oreo firework blizzard treat. Uh, do you want to try the other one first? It's whatever, it's dripping. The other one's dripping. Let's try the other one first. You have to wrap a napkin around it. This one is called the Star Spangled Blizzard. It is uh, it is red, white, and blue through and three with festive rock candy hand blended with Dairy Queen creamy vanilla soft serve topped with more signature Dairy Queen vanilla soft serve with a curl blue rock candy and finished with a DQ Stars and Stripes uh, star kiss frozen treat so i'm gonna pull the frozen treat can i pr pull the frozen treat out hold on i'm pulling the the um the ice cream bar the ice cream one. bar out so this is the ice cream bar and it's just a star shaped i think you got some of the blizzard mm -hmm. itself in there <laughs> we paid for both of these 634 mm -hmm. 634 for both of them. We got the That's mini good. size in both of them. Does it taste just like a bomb pop? Mm -hmm. It does. The white's the best flavor. Mm -hmm. That's good. The bad thing is, mm -hmm. you kind of have to eat that first. You do. While the rest, because there's nowhere to set it. Mm -mm. Yeah, you don't have anywhere to stick this. But Here's you can stick it back in the cup. it's really like getting two desserts in one. Yeah, you really do. Because if one person wanted to eat this, the other person could eat the blizzard. Yeah, and they're many, so you get the same size bar in both. You can get small, medium, or large blizzard, you still get the same size bar. Let me, um, hold on, let me wipe off the edge of my cup here. It's, uh, it's dripping a little bit, so. Yeah, I think you just got to wrap it. Okay, I'm going to wrap it. <laughs> okay, so this, it looks like you get some... Like they're vanilla. What's you, the pink You can't part? see it. <laughs> you can't see it in the sun. We'll have pictures. We took, we took pictures. I like the crunchy. I only got the top with the little pieces of rock, rock candy. And it's literally like rock candy. This isn't popping Your candy. Sugar. It's just rock candy. And the white part is just their regular ice cream. Now, I didn't get any pink at all. Does the pink have a flavor? Yeah, it tastes like um, maybe berry. A cherry? Probably cherry. It kind of tastes like the red part of the popsicle. You get cherry? Mmm. I love the little crunchy. It tastes sugar like pieces. a cherry lifesaver. Yeah. Well, it tastes like the red part of that popsicle to me. Yeah. That's good. I like that. I like that flavor. Um, I will tell you, they didn't have this on the menu anymore. We had to actually ask for it and ask yeah. if they still had it, and they said they did. So. Yeah. So if you do want it, just ask for it. They may still have they it. They may around. have it or they may not. Now this now next that's really one, good. Super sweet with the little sugar crystals. This next one is the blizzard of the month. So it will definitely be around all month long. All July. This is the Oreo firework blizzard tree. It is Oreo cookie pieces and red and blue popping candy blended with creamy dairy cube vanilla soft serve. The mini size is 370 calories. I have no idea how many calories um, the Star Spangled was because it wasn't on the menu. Popping candy is one of those things where, I mean, you get a little bit of the popping, but if you chew popping candy, you really don't get yeah, the popping. You're right. You do if you swallow it. Mm -hmm. Once you've swallowed, you got a few pieces mm -hmm. of popping candy still in your mouth and your teeth. But um, for the most part, you're going to be like chewing this. Because it's got yes. cookies in it. Right. And the popping candy kind of goes away. Yeah. So If real, they had just done vanilla and popping candy, it would have worked better. Yes, I agree. Without the Oreo. I agree. It's good, though. That being said, it's really good. It has a good mm -hmm. Oreo flavor. 
Um, the pop and candy is really good, but I like the other one better. I like the flavor. I like the Oreo anyway. Uh, when I would, when I was buying blizzards all the time. That's what you got. I always got an Oreo blizzard. Um, so the pop and candy, you do get pieces a in your bit, mouth. Yeah. It's, it honestly, it was just gimmicky for the 4th of July. Yeah. The red, white, and blue pop and candy. It's just something you know fireworks pop and these are popping in your mouth so it's something gimmicky that they could do but it does really have a good flavor mm -hmm. yeah I, I like the better, other one better though you do mm -hmm. see i like, I like this the little better. sugar crystals and stuff in the other one i like this one plus for the same price you get an extra dessert you do <laughs> you really do get two desserts in one yeah. so um now that we've eaten some of it I'm going to take another picture because I took the pretty picture at the beginning to show you what they look like. But I'm thinking that you'll be able to see a little bit more in each one of these um, now that we've eaten it. But they are I think they're both good. Mm -hmm. They're definitely worth trying. So if you didn't get them this year, uh, I would try to get it next year. Now this one will be around, the one with the Oreos will be around the whole month of July. So you can still get this one. But like Kevin said, ask about the Star Spangle because you might be able to have, get. They might still have yeah, some because stuff. I would say as long as they have these on hand, they'll have them. They'll be able to make yeah. you up one. Yeah, I would think so. So too. I'd say these little pops all determine if they have them in stock right. or not. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.